Hello, today is Saturday, um, May 29th, 2021. Here is nest number two. Welcome to my raptor watching video. Yes, this is the real thing this time. All right, so you can see the female just sitting or laying in the nest. And I do not see the mate anywhere unless he's laying down somewhere. But yeah, there is the osprey right there. And I do not see an osprey anywhere in that nest, in nest number one. So I guess uh, they didn't have any successful mating going on. So I'm going to go ahead and film nest number three instead. And where did Tom go? Is Tom still there? I don't know. Let's, we'll check and find out. So let me show you where Tom is. He's actually on the lowest branch of this tree right here. It's very rare to see him that low on the branch. It's very, very uncommon. And he is making some chirps. Most likely chirping at another osprey that's flying in his territory. I'm believing so. Unless it's the female. Can't be the female, it's gotta be the male. All right, yeah, so there he is, yeah. Him with his orange-like eyes, yeah. He has the most orange eyes, so that's how you can tell that this is a young one. Okay, so we're gonna do the whole, like, uh, getting closer kind of thing, you know what I mean? Oh, wait, wait, um, he's flapping his wings out. I don't really like the look of that. It's all right, Tom, it's all right. All right, he just did a splat. So splat usually means flight. Splat usually means flight, but maybe not. Maybe, maybe he might decide to stay there. I could be wrong. So yeah, there is, there is another osprey calling in the background. So that should be the female. I, I forgot what I decided on naming the female. I did come up with a name. Uh, I just can't seem to remember what it was. Tom and Sarah? I don't know. Sarah? Were we making it Sarah? I can't, I just can't remember exactly what we decided on naming the female. Hmm. All right, um, I'm gonna just give this, a tr give this a go. I mean, maybe this Osprey might let me get really close to him, or maybe he won't, you know? Usually splat means flight, but he's still staying there, so maybe that's a good thing. Okay, so now that we know that he's there, how about I try to get a little bit closer to Tom, all right? All right, so this is gonna be tricky. So I'm gonna need to pause this. So hang on a second, pausing, pausing the video. Uh, I just missed him catching, oh wait, did he catch something? Oh man, I, pa I accidentally hit the unpause button instead of the other button, but let's see, let's see what he does now. Yeah, sorry about the footage, it's not so great, but. Um, and then he seemed to have landed there. And what happened? Did he catch something? I didn't mean to do that. I'm so sorry, Tom. Aw. I didn't know you were up there. I had no idea. Dang, Tom. Oh, wait, there he is. I found him. And he just flew. And now where is he going? Oh, wait, he's being chased by a bird. Hey, don't bother. Don't be bothering that osprey. All right, let's watch. Let's watch to see what this osprey does. Maybe it's because I'm holding the drone in my hand. Maybe that has something to do with it. I can only take a speculation. Aw, he flew over to that light pole right there. All right, so we'll try again, okay? I'm just gonna sit down right here. Tom's making some peeping sounds right now. Tom's not being his usual self today. What's the matter, struggling to catch fish? You just can't seem to catch any? Is that what's wrong? All right, my focus is bad, okay. Is that you peeping? Is that you making that sound? Oh, here he goes, uh, once again. For the third time, he flies off. It's okay, it's okay, Tom. What's the matter? All right, let me see what osprey this is before I uh, 
do something foolish. Okay? Um, it's Victor. Victor? I think it's Victor. I think it is Victor. Either that or it's the male osprey that's on the other side. Man, what's what's the matter with you, Osprey? Cool it. All right, Victor. Let's try this again. Well, I say try this again, but let's try having me get close to you this time. Oh, man. Oh, man. Now they're both gone. Oh. Oh. Must be my drone. That's probably why. They seem to act very fearful towards this drone for some reason. Oh. I mean, I give up. I can't film any Osprey today. Today's just not my day. Oh. Oh, come on, Osprey. Come back. It's all right. It's okay, Osprey. No, that's not going to help bring him back. Guess what? I found the two Ospreys. There they are, sitting on this bare branch tree right here. I did not notice that. Oh, wow. I'm pretty sure that's Tom and... Okay, so now we're going to give this a go here. Unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to get as close to these Osprey because if I try to get closer, the tops of those trees are going to be obstructing the view. Yes, they picked a spot that's near the nest. Let me just show you where this is at here in relation to the nest. So there they are, and there's the nest. So they want to pick a spot that's close to their nest, where they can see their nest in the open and they just happened to pick this tree branch after flying away from me. Now I don't know if this other osprey was here but I do know that this male osprey is making territorial calls at the other male osprey. So I think what I'll do is I'll keep this in center frame here and I'll just film both of these osprey from this spot, okay? Put that just like that. Okay, there we go. Now I zoom in just a little bit more, possibly. Okay, and about right there I think is good. Yeah, that's good. Okay. Yep, so you can see both Osprey and they seem to be being attacked by red-winged blackbirds. Hey, red-winged blackbirds, get away from those Osprey! They live here. All right. Um, it's 7.43. 7.43. So I'm going to have to get going. So I'll record these Osprey for just a few more minutes. I'm sure they'll be just fine right here for the night. I'm sure that other osprey was probably, the male osprey was probably Lou from the other nest. I named the osprey from nest number two, Sue and Lou. And this is Tom and Sally. I don't know who, who but to name the Sally. Is that who we should name the female? I'm not sure what we should name the female. I keep forgetting. I just wish Tom could just let me get close to him. But I think he was kind of being distracted because he was trying to catch a fish from out of the lake, but he was unsuccessful. If he had actually caught it and actually went up to the tree with it, that Osprey would have let me watch him eat. But instead, he's up there trying to focus on his concentration of hunting in this lake. And I don't know why he flew over to that field. I got no clue. And I do know one thing, there's not enough time for me to use this drone at this point. And I've only got literally a few minutes left, so I'm going to have to skedaddle in a second.
Is that the osprey making that sound? I'm trying to look for a pin, a pin, a pin, a pin for my, for my drone. Can't seem to find it anywhere. I thought I had it in here somewhere. I think is this it? No. This is just a tiny little propeller. That's not going to work. That's not what I need. There was a tiny little thing that I had here, and I thought it was in here. Ah, crapola. I could have sworn it was in here somewhere. Oh, and I finally found my lens cap for my camera. That's great. I was looking for that. Well, that's good news, but I do have to get going. And as long as I know that I can find my my thing somewhere, where could it be? Mm, still can't see it here. Uh, nope, not in there. Not in there, not in there anywhere. I had it. Ah. Nope, 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 nope. Hmm. And they're both still there. That's good. Okay. Uh, I can't find it. I couldn't have put it in this bag, I mean, it's going to be hard for me to look through this whole bag for it. Yeah, I'll have to go home and grab it. I give up. Yeah. Alright, I got no time. I could have sworn I had it in here. Hmm. Bang. Okay, all right, you guys, all right. All right, Osprey, you win. I'm going home. So they'll be all right right here. It's not like they're in an inconvenient place. They are. And there's not too many dead tree branches for them to perch on. They like to pick dead tree branch because they can get a wider view of the area from that branch. So that's always a good thing. It's always something to look forward to. All right, I am out of here. Let me zoom in. Oh, first, let me just zoom in way quick on this one right here. Okay, I believe that's the male. And then assuming my calculations are correct, this should be the female since she's got more brown on the chest. I can't see her chest, but I know this is the female and the one on the left is the male. Okay. Right? Which one's larger? One on the right seems larger. So the one on the right is the female. Yeah. Yeah, I know that one's got more prominent 
brown on the chest line, even though you can't see it from this angle. Okay, that's it. Got to go. Until next time, I'll see you on Thursday. Take care, everybody.